Hello guys, Damien from Version Free Technology bringing you another quick tutorial. This one on how to gain S off on your HTC One. Um, prerequisites are you need the Android SDK installed on your Mac. And let's head over to the XDA Developers Forum. And I will leave this link in the description. This is a little tool that's been built by um, Revolutionary. Uh, it's called Rev1. And this should help you gain S off. It's not foolproof. Um, hopefully it'll work first time. So just quickly download that. Once you've downloaded it, we need to just uh, just move it to a suitable location. I'm just going to drag this to my desktop, like so. I'm going to open a terminal window, and we need to CD into our SDK location. Mine is in Applications, Android, SDK, blah, 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 blah. Can't actually remember exactly off the top of my head. Um, I'm recording this voiceover after actually doing recording the uh, tutorial. And if you can hear footsteps, that's my dogs. So we just need to uh, ADB devices, just to check the devices there, it's their standard stuff. Um, next is ADB push, and then drag the file onto the uh, terminal window. And then we're gonna push it to forward slash data, forward slash local floor, forward slash TNP, forward slash, and that's pushed it to the uh, phone. Next is ADB shell, let's get into the shell, we're going to cd into that location, so cd forward slash data forward slash local forward slash tmp and then just ls here to just to make sure it's there, it's there look and the next stage is to chmod 755 rev1 go and then we're actually going to run it. So it's dot forward slash ch. No, it's not. It's rev one dash capital P. Hit the go button and let's hope it works. In fact, to say let's hope it works, I know it works because, like I said before, I pre recorded this. I'm just doing the voiceover now. So there we go. Done. So exit and ADB reboot. Right, once the phone has rebooted, we need to just uh, forward slash ADB shell. Let's get back into the shell, CD back into that folder again. So it's CD forward slash data forward slash local forward slash TMP. Go. And then forward slash dot forward slash rev one space minus s or dash sorry dash s zero space zero space dash u hit the go button and we should see things start to happen. There you go, rev one successful. So exit out of there and adb reboot. You can just re you could just reboot to bootloader there. I just did the reboot. I don't know why, but you could do it that way. ADB reboot and then dot forward slash ADB reboot bootloader. I just go straight to bootloader. It'll be quicker for you. And I will then show you. There we go. Look up there. So we've got S off up the top there, and you can also see my SID is HTC. 001. So now we're going to gain Super SID, which seems to be uh, what everyone wants to do. Um, if you don't know what SID stands for, it's just carrier identification number. So dot forward slash fast boot reboot. Let's reboot back. I'm just thoroughly going through all the steps here, so you don't, you probably don't have to do that. You could have probably just uh, reboot from the phone using the up and down, the, the volume up and down, and the power button. So once you're back in, um, we're going to dot forward slash ADB reboot bootloader. That will get us back into the bootloader again. Now once we've done that, once we're back in the bootloader, um, we can then work with Fastboot to change the SID. But first off, let me just uh, take you into Safari and we'll have a look at this thread here. I will also leave the description, the link in the description for this thread as well. This is uh, 
that all the ones, the top ones, is the Super Sid, and then you've got um, all the different carrier SIDs as well. That's the one I'm currently using. Mine was an O2 branded, it's now that. Um, so this thread actually tells you how to change your SID, so you could just copy and paste from here if you want, if you like. But if not, you can follow along here. So dot forward slash fast boot OEM write CID and then just for, for ease go back to this and copy all those ones just so you know how many ones you've uh, got to put in there. I suppose you could memorize it if you wanted to and paste and done. Now just fast boot reboot again or um, fast boot or you do it from the phone if you want it's probably easier because you then don't have to worry you can boot straight into the bootloader from the phone um, I've just rebooted and then rebooted the bootloader again and you will now see and if you can hear crying in the background that's uh, my son not getting his own way clearly and here we go again I'll just show you an image and there's the change of CID done and dusted Right, the next thing, I'm going to go and change my SID back to what I was using before. And the next stage for us here is to revert all of this back to S on again and to remove the unlocked above the uh, S off text. Just basically put it back to the way it was before. Um, so that's the that's the. the that's what I'm using for my SID now. So I'm just going to revert this back quickly while you're here. Done. That's it. It's done. Um, and we'll now revert this back to as it was before. So ADB into the shell. Once you've rebooted the phone, that is, of course. Then we're going to CD back into that location where Rev1 is held. So CD, forward slash data, forward slash local, forward slash TMP. Now we're there, we can just dot forward slash rev1 minus L to lock the phone back up. You need to lock the bootloader first. So once we have success here, if we don't, we'll have to run this again. But once we have success, like we do, rev1 successful, so we can exit. And we can ADB reboot bootloader because we can now use fast boot to finish. So dot forward slash fast boot OEM right secure flag space three and that will that will turn S off off and you'll be S on again. And there we go. Look up the top. S on locked. Handset as it was, but with a new SID. And all done, guys. That is the end of this tutorial. I hope it helps for you guys on Mac. And um, I'll see you in the next one. Cheers, guys. Bye bye.